Hey guys, Harsh here back in the video. So once you have upgraded your RAM, you are thinking why my gaming laptop is not like gaming. So that's why because you have not upgraded the processor. So I'm going to show you how you can use this laptop with this processor. So let's get started. Okay, so this is the processor right here. And as you can see, it is pretty good looking processor, but do not go for the looks, go for the guts. So as you can see that it has thousands or hundreds of little pins right here you can see these are gold plated for the best conductivity and low rate of corrosion and it is a delayed processor and delayed processors are best or the ideal choice for laptops so let's do the ritual that we do with laptops flip the laptop around unplug the battery remove the screws Okay, so once all the screws are removed, then you can just pop the back plate out, just like this, and keep it aside for the moment. Then as you can see, this is the cooling fan right here. This is the GPU and this will be the processor. So for what we need to do now is remove this whole fan contraption. So first of all, we will unplug the fan right here, which is connected in its little port right here. And then we will remove these screws. So the whole fan just lift out of the contraption. And here you can see that this is the processor right here. So in most of the other, the only thing is the processor is upgradable and not the GPU. So as you can see, the GPU is soldered onto the motherboard right here, but the CPU right here it can be removed now in different types of letter there will be different locking mechanism for the processor so in this case it is the screw method so what you need to do is take your screwdriver the flathead one and then just put it right here and then just spin it counterclockwise to loosen the mechanism and then the, the processor should lift out pretty easily so as you can see right here the processor has lifted out now we can keep it aside and take our new processor and as you can see right here that there is a simple arrow right here that you need to match with the motherboard or the socket so just align the processor right here and make sure that it is not moving too much so give it a little wiggle and then just take your screwdriver again and then just lock it in place now this is the very important thing to apply the thermal paste and if you forgot to apply thermal paste then your processor will be dead within hours so let's apply some thermal paste to it that's good and you can apply some thermal paste to the processor or the gpu right here and uh, i'm going to just leave it like that because this laptop is not functioning either way so take the fan thing or whatever it is called again and then just align it perfectly and then just place it in then what you need to do is undo the all things that you just did to open up the processor okay so now we are done with the laptop processor upgrade now we can go ahead and do some serious game 